I was not supposed to be in line today. Uh, uh, good day. This is uh, Professor Mega Comrade Officer Ranamiro Adegbe, uh, the open leader of People Freedom Movement. As we all understand, I don't normally come online today. Uh, but however, uh, the situation on ground is not a situation where anyone can say, let us be quiet and wait. As you understand, as a man, a security man or a security personnel here in the United States, I have learned one thing that uh, even the Federal Bureau of Investigation, the FBI in the United States, there is a protocol that they followed. When a man is kidnapped or a woman is kidnapped, when a test is billionaire, daughter was kidnapped in the back in the 80s i read about it so within one to 48 hours or let's move forward between one to 48 or one to 72 hours is a a rescue mission so it's a rescue mission we have been kidnapped between one hour to the next 24 hours the FBI call it a rescue mission when it become 72 hours 
the system will be changed to recovery mission. Recovery. It's no longer a rescue. Just let's recover his body or her body. That is one thing I learned in the United States. I don't think it is any other country that knows it's better than America. They should challenge what I'm saying. And uh, I'm not the only one who is a security in the United States. I'm not the only Nigerian who is the most mountainous man in the United States. But I know I am the most courageous, the most honest, the most dedicated African American who love his state, who love his country, who have the love for Africa more than any other person in this globe today. I am the number one. If you think you love your country more than I do, or you love Nigeria more than I do, you love Africa more than I do, you love a do state more than me, what are you waiting for? Why are you silent? If you even think you know better than I do, what are you waiting for? So whatever you know is rubbish, is garbage. You know what I'm saying? It's garbage. You can do the talking. Just talk, 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 you know, gossiping. That's all you know how to do. I tell me, I'm not a professor. I am a professor in security. I'm not a professor in other way. Wisdom, I am a professor. Understanding, I am a professor. Communication, I am a professor. I'm not a political scholar. No. I am working with what I read in school. I am not a man who will go and read a civil engineer and become a mechanic on the street. No. I read what I read is what I'm working with. That is to tell you, whatever it is I do, I put my eye on it. I am not trying to read to be read a criminal justice or uh, uh, become a professional in security department and I'll be working as a banker. No, that is not what a Ramamiro is. Whatever I read is what I'm working with. That is to tell you tomorrow, if I say something, this is what I'm going to do, is what I'm going to do. I am not going to let any amount of money or any greed of money persuade me to do what I am not supposed to do. That is not what I am. That is not me. You can go ahead and criticize and do whatever it is. You can see it and be writing, writing, writing. What have you done? Let, let me ask you a question right now. Our father, Ambassador Salmori Joseph, I called since yesterday. I have called almost all the dignitaries in Edo State. In Nigeria. Where have I not called? What can we do? If I did not call you, that means I know that you, are, you don't have the best interest of a do state. Or you don't have the best interest of the security of your country. That is why I did not call you. I might laugh with you, but I know who you are. If you think Iran Omigo or Mega Comrade is going to come out and start criticizing kidnapper, it's a lie. Those are vulnerable children who were forced are the bad men against the war? They have no job. They were driven away from their home. Some of them were ticket drivers. Some of them, their wives were working. Let me tell you, in Benin proverb, we normally say, "Well, it is rat that is inside house." We tell outside rat what is happening. So. And if Rome did, do not condemn you or did not condemn you, outside can never do it. I don't care if it's full and he has me. Boko Haram full and he has me are the one kidnapping people. If a do indigi, Bini indigi, do not evolve, did not evolve, or have not evolved. That kidnapping will not be successful. It will not. If your family or your carcass, your friends and well wishers are not involved, he will never happen. 
I work with criminals. You read when you work in a prison, you 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 think like them, you behave like them, you talk like them, you have to communicate with them, go to their own world, know what is their problem, understand why some of them are there, they didn't do nothing. So when you can be able to move your mind one side or the other, you can be able to communicate with a lot of people. That is the wisdom. Every little thing they turn into politics. Iranomigo is this. Iranomigo is that. Now I call every station in Nigeria, most all of them. All of those st stations is doing playing us our modern music. That's all they can do. RTV. I try to contact the owner. And I will give update about it. ITV is owned by our father, Dr. Gabriel Sawaru Igmenedion, whom I very, very much respect for what he has done in Edo State. My, my message is that a purpose. We need media right now to free this man. As we gather, those Amore Joseph is not physically fit to sustain or to withstand this stress. Who knows what have happened? They didn't know his situation. They kidnapped him in order to get money. Situation get worse. Something happened. They panic. They don't know what to do. Osamori cannot stand on his own according to the information I have gathered. Even when he played in the upper palace, someone escorted him to the stage. A man, someone escort that tried to run. Do you know what is called cardiac arrest or panic attack or whatever it is? This is what I tell people. Before you threaten someone and say, I will kill you, I will do that. You are not the major problem. The problem is the word that comes out of your mouth. You don't know the situation of who you are attacking or who is surrounding you. They can voice that your anger and commit what they are not supposed to. I can just be walking on the street now. They say, oh, amigo, let me fight him. You are thinking you were going to fight me, but you don't know what, what kind of medical challenge I am. In the moment you give me one blow, thinking that, oh, this man is so strong. Then, I will just fall down and die. That was not your intent. Your intent was not to come and kill an enemy, but your intent was to come and torture me. You process or try to torture me. You don't know what I'm going through. I have not eaten since. Even my wife asked me a while ago, honey, have you eaten? Even some of my friends, girlfriends around the world, male friend, whatever. Have you eaten? No. I drink almost half a gallon of milk yesterday. I have never done that. To tell you, I didn't know what was going through my mind. I tried to call on myself to be happy to my loved ones, but I wasn't. We have everybody now come out, release audio, do this, do that. What have you done other than audio or coming out on social media? Every effort I have made to bring a do people out have sound in a deaf ear. That is a good question. Costa, why only in a do state? That is a very good question. Because a do state have become a terrorist haven. A do state have become militant state whenever you speak you will be bound not to even come to your own town you know what i'm saying hold on hello hey, yes on uh, but online i hope you know that everybody is listening Okay, my mother actually has way of saying, when you tell me, I don't want to tell you, Baba. Eh, but you want to be my mother, Baba? Oh. Oh, my. Oh, that's nobody. Oh, my, oh, my, as a question, as a question. We're sending message, give me. I don't know where I go, I don't know where I go. We're sending the message, we're sending the message, we're sending the message, we're sending the message, we're sending the message. Okay, that's all. Oh, my, Baba. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. 
So, the truth is that a those state has a what we call camouflage governor. I know by power of God. If God, God Almighty, God Almighty, God in heaven is watching, my prayer is for Obaseki to resign. To resign. This is not personal between me and Obaseki. But it is personal when the safety of a state is hanging in the balance. The safety of the poor citizen, not only the poor citizen, the middle class. When Obaseki failed to identify threat, to identify problem, to identify insecurity in his own say, state, that made me believe Obaseki is a failure. And I was warning other people. I'll be warning them, but they don't listen because I am a product of Oriyama. They don't want Oriyama to speak. Hello? Hello? Yes, do you know you are online, direct? Yeah. Yeah, Baba. Okay, speak English, please. Oh, I told you, uh, Naga Comrade. God bless you. Please, yes, English. Yes, 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 he said, Jesus, I am calling from Nigeria, uh, Benin. Oh, God bless you. Yes, 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 yes. God bless you. No, no, I was saying, where are you? Where's your time? Where's your time? Where's your time? Where's your time? Because, uh, uh, I'm not going to be a big kid now. Okay, I'm going to be a big kid now. I'm going to be a big kid now. I'm going to be a big kid now. It's one of the highest price the money they do. Why are you? Hey, why no? And the most crazy way, uh, we have to buy a lot here. No, we want a heavy man. Oh, we have a lot more born here. Yeah, do a move. Uh, because, hey, no, 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 we're talent. I'm a nigga. I'm a very young man. I'm a talent. Oh, what a talent. Because they're a young man. Oh, we're here. What's it? I'm a nigga. I'm a nigga. I'm a comment. I'm a rubbish. Yeah, 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 yeah the fact of the matter with the cranny, or all that's what I may, I may want. Uh, Lao, they say, you want to say, you want to say, broken English, Lao, uh, people watching you. Okay. Mm. Okay. The fact of the matter say, we wait there this day, now we know what will happen. Now people wait there Europe, or people wait there America. If, uh, they got comrades, they talk. So, you say maybe to talk or whatever. How you will drive people into a house? You don't give them work. Mm -hmm. You say you want to create 200,000 jobs. Mm -hmm. The 200,000 jobs you want to create. The people went there, you know, they regulate them. Then you know how you want to do them. You pursue all of the entire The only thing that with these cities in jail for uh, uh, those states, that we say, some of those people, they already pass legal routes, come out. And they come out, they deport them. They carry the come back. They carry the come back. People will carry their wallet, come out, sell property, sell road, come out for this dead state. Then they carry the comeback. Carry the comeback, come do which work. No work, no fun, nothing. Every day we hear governor go to uh, Dubai. He goes this, he goes that, he goes that. Like that one, people will be this state office of us. The only thing we will have to beg now, say, our papa will be carry. Now beg, we go beg. Now beg, beg, we go beg. Because that man, he never chop castle of money, he never chop anything. He never a fire senator, as of threat, uh, 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 big politician go carry. Not be who they suffer, think. Yeah, they will go carry. Thank you, sir. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Call. Where is he? Thank you. He said, "Call." Thank you. You can see a man who dedicated his time. He used his money to call United States. When even a politician, you call them. When you ask them, "Do you want me to call you back?" They will say yes. As 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 rich as they are, that is called greed of money. Here you have individual in a do state. I know it. Let me tell the do people. Everything I'm doing online, our father is watching me every day. Every day is watching. I want to bring that news to you. If what I'm doing, the chief, the Nikki, they are calling me, begging me. They are begging me. They cannot speak. Lao wu wera no migo. Esimaye ni maye. All these rubbish people that is coming online, ratty rubbish, like my brother said. You are not a Bini. You don't know what is happening. You are only looking for appointment. 
If people on ground, the Onigians, are begging me not to stop, who are you? Let me tell you what happened. Governor Baseki, how many times I have told Governor Baseki, tell me one word that an amigo has spoken about that have not come to pass. Am I a native doctor? There is no one word that I have spoken about that have not come. If I was a church or a, 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 a preacher of a, a whatever they call it, if I wasn't a freedom preacher, I would have been having 10 story building by now. Because whatever I say, it happened. Why? Because God in me is the most powerful God of truth and honesty. When PFM does not go to cemetery to seek for power. PFM go nowhere to seek for power. Our power are God Almighty and the law enforcement agency around the world. When Obaseki, we are going to drive market women. I warn him. I ask Obaseki, have you built another market that you're going to take them to? Obaseki cannot run away from Salomori Joseph kidnapping. Obaseki is the pastor and back and the master planner of the reason why Osamori Joseph was kidnapped. Obaseki and his thugs is terrorist gang, militant. Obaseki is responsible. Governor Obaseki and his uh, police commissioner Gwandu. Why would Obaseki fought to Tane to retain police commissioner Gwandu after I fought to Tane to remove him three, four times? Spend my own money. Spend PSM money. IG is watching. He has I. He doesn't hear. Ibrahim Idris, Inspector General of Police. He, he, you have I. You don't see. You have ear. You don't hear. You have mouth, but you cannot talk. Now, you want to destroy those state inspector general police. You want to destroy it. Obaseki came to Abuja and bring Ghana must go. Bring millions of money to you. If you deny it, come to United States. Come and face polygraph test of FBI. You are a law enforcement officer. And you are way, you are way smart. You know what I'm talking about. Come and take a lie detective test. If you do, if you did not collect a penny from Governor Obaseki when he visited you in Abuja or transfer money to you, come and take a lie detective test. If you fail it, I will volunteer myself into a mock jail. If you, if you pass it, I mean, if you pass it, and if you fail it, you lost in jail in the United States. Take the challenge. You are nobody. You are just like a common human man. I don't know why Nigerian people are afraid of you. We only respect elders who want to save us. We do not respect elders who want to destroy us. How many children will respect a father that want to kill him? Or how many children will respect a mother that want to kill him? If my mother want to kill me, do you think I will respect her? No. Nobody wants to die. Nobody wants their parents to kill them. Or if you want to kill your son, do you think your son will respect you? No. If you are a leader, uh, you are a leader. You want to evoke uh, with the respect our people for home. Who the hell is you? What is respect when death is involved? Can anybody respect us? i Joseph and bring him out now. No. No. No phone call. Nobody have called. Nobody have claimed money. Nobody has said, I need $10,000. We need $40,000. Nobody. That is to tell you the perpetrators. The kidnappers are in state of confusion. They don't know what to do anymore. Story has changed. I cannot say it. And Opaseki will pay for it. He will pay for it legally. Here you have Obaseki cannot produce 50, 50 security police vehicle. Obaseki cannot buy even 50 police vehicle for the good police officer to use to secure those state. Oshomule did not did it. Three years before Oshomule left power, they have not bought police officer one vehicle. But they have given police officer 
Il commissionne à Guadeloupe 31 millions every month. 31 million naira. Between 5 to 10 million. Every month commission I'm going to do is taking outside the salary. So, Obaseki came to power. Now Obaseki is running from uh, Malaysia to Dubai to Hong Kong. Very soon, PFN will be having power there. You have no place to go. And if Osamori Joseph did not come home safely, none of your cabinet will travel. We will put a band in all your cabinet. Legally, we will go to every law enforcement agency and report you. You are responsible for the kidnapping of Ambassador Osamori Joseph. Why, how are you responsible, responsible for it? I will tell you. Number one, you came into power. You did not create job. You were destroying job. Those that were feeding in Ring Road, you unleash your police commissioner to be collecting 150,000 from them. They run into driving. To go to get. You send Tony Kabaka to go and chase them inside. They were beating to get the boys. If they cannot, one person cannot come out. I saw it on video. Even Tony Kabaka said it himself. Those are the people that say Tony is happy. Who is he happy now? Is he by leading Obaseki to, to, to the kidnapping of Ambassador Samore Joseph? Can Tony become Ambassador Samore Joseph? Who is Obaseki? Who the hell is Governor Obaseki? Who is Obaseki? Is Obaseki or Samore meet? Eh? Ala Guata, Wama Guata, we are the Wagi Huamua. Can you replace Osamore Joseph with Tony Kabaka? You see? You see? No. Osamore, he will continue to review people one by one. And I'm going leave Tony alone. Little huh? Tony said he want to kill me. And Tony, if Tony is not ready to kill me, why haven't Tony come out since I asked him to come out and make a video that I will not kill you, Anomigo? Because he knows it's in his mind. What is in his mind? The mind of a criminal. I know it. I work with criminals. Eh, he told me they have a baba, machema, 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 machema. Really? Really? Is that what a dust state become right now? Are you serious? Illiteracy is not an excuse in order to create terrorism. Tony Kabaka is a terrorist. And Obaseki is a terrorist sympathizer and a terrorist sponsor. Governor Godwin uh, Obaseki and uh, his father, Adam Ali Oshomule, are the founder and the creator of terrorism in those states. APC turn a blind eye against them. Turn a, a, a deaf ear on them. That is why APC will go down as once upon a time party in a do state. Now, Osamore Joseph is nowhere to be found. How many of you can come out? I know how many people have called. Tomorrow now they say, what is the Ranomigo's problem? Obaseki is a shameless man. Obaseki is a heartless man. Obaseki is not a godly man. Obaseki have no soul. Obaseki have no soul. Obaseki is evil. Obaseki is a terrorist. Obaseki is a bad governor. Obaseki is the worst of Edo citizen ever. Can you imagine a man that do not even have mercy upon his family? How will he have mercy upon you? Those that want to clap for Obaseki, you can go ahead with you. Go ahead and clap with him. Go ahead. Obaseki can never feed me in his life. I have worked genuine money more than Obaseki in his life. Who the hell is Obaseki? Is it God that the old Edo will be afraid of two men? Two men are running Edo into ground. Obaseki and Governor Adamo Shobule. 
Oshobule went to Kevin that he did not even fix. He did not know how Kevin was created. Now he's forced to satisfy his wife with money, 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 money. And the children are watching and they are quiet. They are planning. How are we going to do it, How are we going to stop this? Instead of you to plan how to save a do state from the hands of terrorists. Nobody called for Osayamori at all. They did not demand money. They did not ask for one penny. Why? Ask yourself. Is Osayamori Joseph still alive? It's a question. Mistakenly, when they tried to force him, did he fall and collapse? It's a question. Are they afraid to take him to the hospital? It's a question. Now, as I speak to you, Edo people, Nigeria, Commissioner Gwando is not even in Edo State. As I speak to you, nobody in Edo State is looking for Samori Joseph other than musicians, some sympathizers. They are scared to come out. I spoke with them. A lot of them tell me, Ranomigo, Ohangi Magwa, we cannot talk. We cannot talk. It will take by the grace of God Almighty for a state to come back the way Lucky Gunidion left it. Now I am praying. If a state can come back in safe, forget about road. What is road? Now, Lucky Gunedion is better than Obaseki, better than Oshimole. Ask Lucky. I don't know him. He has not given me one penny. I don't even know him. Me, myself, personally, I don't like Lucky, but I love his father. Lucky is the one that brings this problem to us. If not Lucky, there will be no Oshimole. That is why I don't like him. I, say, I don't like him. I don't care. I don't want him to like me. I'm not here for anybody to like me. I'm here to speak the truth. How can I go to work now? Do you know what? In my job, they tell you whatever problem you got at home, leave it by the door. Don't come to this job with your garden problem. When you come down there to your job with your problem, you'll be sad. They'll send you home. You'll be fired. Would I rather get fired or I would rather respect myself? Stay home. How can I survive this? When problem is here and there, I'm not a governor. I'm not in any political office. Attack is coming from right and left. And let me warn other state, on those state, if you think this problem is a those state alone, it's going to spread if you do not face it. If you do not do what Governor Wiki of Bayasa is doing, you do not do what Fire Fa is doing, it is the state governor. If you practice Governor Adam Oshomule, and Governor Obaseki, the worst governor ever. And here you have disgrace from a do disgrace sellout. They are still coming out and say Obaseki is working. How can you say Obaseki is working when Osamori Joseph is nowhere to be found? Let me give me a second. Let me give you a list. Just give me a second. I'm going to give you a list. Please give me a second. God. God. Oh God. Jesus. Jesus. God, help me. Know what I'm saying? Just give me one second. I'm going to be right back in a few minutes. So, sorry about that, brothers and sisters. Like as I was saying, 
This message goes to all Nigerians and all Edo State citizens. Please stop being scared. Don't kill yourself before you be killed or before they kill you. When you silent and you are not talking, you are killing yourself. Whether you talk, you're gonna die. If you don't talk, you're still gonna die. Death is gonna come. Death is inevitable. No one can escape it. Do you want to die as a real hero? Or to die as nobody? Obaseki is very smart. They know where to hit. They know where not to hit. They know where to hit. Let me tell you, the day Obaseki and his gang will touch an American citizen, that will be the end of Obaseki regime in a do state. Then Obaseki will know that his passport, number one, is an American citizen, will be in jeopardy. Obaseki know what he's doing. He's very smart. He's criminal smart. Obaseki have no sympathy for anybody. Governor Obaseki of Edo State, if you know that man, he's worse than Saddam Hussein. He's worse than Gaddafi. A man who came from Lagos, a Benin man, Osamore Joseph, tell me who did not like Osamore Joseph. Is Osamore Joseph insulting you? No. Why do you kidnap Osamore Joseph? And the information I gathered that Obaseki heard that some musicians, Osamore Joseph and others, were going to protest against the situation and insecurity in Edo State in about a few days. So, how could it be a coincidence? Why is federal government not calling on the governor Obaseki? Why? Because no Edo indigenous is reporting to federal government. They are all scared. They are all scared. Oshomule that used Osaimoro Joseph. You use him. You gave it to Obaseki. Obaseki use him. All they could do is to kidnap him. Oshomule, how can you eat? How can you stay without coming out in the media and speak? Obaseki, they will not be a politician. Why are you not a politician? Why are you not a politician? Why are you not a politician? You cannot come out to call for immediate release of Ambassador Osamore Joseph. On a head and amigo now, this is Osamore Joseph. Obaseki, why? Larry, I will tell Obaseki that he will be now. Why are you not a politician? Why can't you people call him? Governor, I want to tell the Edo people, Governor Obaseki is nobody. Governor Obaseki is a governor for four years. If Governor Obaseki step his foot in the United States, it will be, Iranomi who is bigger than him. I can go everywhere in the United States, carry as many weapons I want to carry. Obaseki cannot try it. Obaseki has never wear khaki. He has never wear uniform. He has never saved anybody in his life. And one touch, FBI will numb him. He will be brought to question him. He's going to stumble because he's a terrorist sponsorer. Governor Obaseki of Edo State sponsored terrorists, kidnappers, human trafficker. Obaseki know what he was doing. That is why he launched war against human trafficking. But he was what they call criminal will throw you, throw you off the hook. When they know you are on their team, and they want to throw you off the curve, they will launch something that they are against. And actually, that is what Obaseki is doing. That is what Obaseki is doing. Obaseki destroyed Ring Road. He said he wants to fix it. He drive market women, men and women inside the house. How are you going to insult a kidnapper? When their children are dying in the hospital, their children are dying everywhere. They have no money to feed them. And you, you are there as a rich man, you are clapping for Obaseki. Uh, what is going to happen to you? What do you think is going to happen to you? Eh? If you think, hello? Hello? Yeah, who is it? 
Yeah, my name is Sumpe from uh, Wesley at uh, Germany. Okay, do you, do you know that I'm on live? I'm on live video. Oh, right now? Yes. So you are live. Everyone is hearing you. So you might want to hang up. Oh, okay, okay. Okay. Uh, do I, I can join you, please. Okay, you can oh. join me. Call me in about an hour. Oh, okay, okay. I All will right. do that. All right. Thank, Thank you. you. So, if you think I came out to insult kidnapper, you are joking. I will not insult kidnapper. I will not insult Boko Haram. I will not insult any Islamic religion because they are not the problem. Corruption is the problem. The truth of the matter is corruption is the problem. The situation in Edo State right now is, has not getting worse. If Edo State people refuse to call home and speak to the governor, watch. Let me break this news. A lot of people have heard about what has happened in Edo State recently. Let me just tell you, Mr. Mr. Andy Ianire, Executive Director of Bazoom and Terrorism, kidnapped in his office with his three police security shot dead. Three police officer shot dead when Ianire was kidnapped. Andy Ianire. Andy Yanire is the brother to Desi Danjuma, Senator Danjuma. Andy Yanire is a brother to Senator Danjuma. To tell you all these people that do not think about poor people, let me tell you, death does not choose who is going to kill. You might think you have all the money. Are you protect yourself? How are you sure that your family are being protected? Now you see where he goes. Kidnapping goes. He did not went to Danjuma. He went to his brother. Now the innocent man lost his life. Or kidnapped, I mean. Three police officers were shot dead in Nigeria. FBI, if you are listening, three police officers who were assigned to protect this gentleman, Andy Yanere, when Go make it to his office to kidnap him. They kill the three police officer in a do state, and a do state governor have not spoken anything about it. That is number one. Number two, Ye Osamore Joseph was kidnapped after he played for the anniversary of our inauguration of our father. My respect, sir. So after Samuel Joseph was kidnapped, Governor Obaseki refused to speak about it. Last night, Professor Otazo were assassinated. Last night, faculty of engineer, University of Benin, who live in uh, Alarodaro Street, Osiloko Road, Benin City, a vibrant professor was killed and murdered, assassinated in a dust state less than 24 hours. Professor have been killed, murdered. Icon, legend are under captivity. He's been adopted. Now he cannot go out. How can you adopt a legend? Less than few hours. Professor is killed. How is that possible? Hello. Hello, I'm alive. Oh. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, hello. I said I'm alive. I'm alive. People are hearing you. You stop. You cut it out there. So, that is it. A professor was murdered in a do state yesterday and up to now, nobody is speaking. So, if you want to keep quiet, keep, keep, keep doing it. If Fulani has me, Boko Haram Fulani has me, we are the one that kidnapped Abbasado Samori Joseph, who assassinated the professor. Eh? 
professor Tazuwe, who has admitted in faculty of engineering. Where are the university students? That is the question. Where are the youth? They are killing your professor. They are killing legend. They are kidnapping legend. The youth, you are there busy. I, I already know people in Nigeria, they are not insulting me. It's all those people that is trying to get an appointment at the one insulting PFM. So, what have a basic done? Those that think they're smart, let me tell you, President Trump, only one statement is make, only one statement is make against, only one statement that I am helping the Puerto Ricans see what he paid for it. They blame Harrow King on President Trump. The dead, the dead in Las Vegas is there. President Trump came out and speak about it. For those those of you that are not educated, who are not learning, when you have executive governor, I, don't just be a guru and be a governor follower. Let me educate you. When you have a governor of a state, is the executive leader of that state. Whatever happened under his administration is responsible for it. Security, employment, name it, is responsible for it. So if an amigo call Obaseki out and you are there, he's calling my governor, he's calling my governor, he's calling my governor because you are an illiterate, you are not educated. You might go to university, but you are just a university goer. You did not go there to study. You went there and practiced your kidnapping and assassination ring. If a do state is good, they will praise him. If a do state is bad, Obaseki is responsible for it. God forbid anything happen to me tomorrow or any member of my PFM. Obaseki, Obaseki will be will be brought to justice. I will file. I will not say something happened in his region. I will say this is what Obaseki did. He sent his military gang to assassinate or to terrorize my PFM members. Obaseki will be brought to justice. That will make it easy for me. Bam. He already know that. So Obaseki is not, it can be off the hook of people in Nigeria. Obaseki is not off the hook of me or PFM. Obaseki should provide security in a do state with immediate effect. That is all we're asking for. Iranomigo did not beg over beg Obaseki to give me an uh, appointment. I don't need it. But I want a do state people to know help is on the way. All hope are not lost. I want you to know, in 2019, a man will come out. That man, you will not even believe it. And he's going to be forced to come and save us from all this insecurity in Edo State. PSM will make it. Before the election, this man will even win. He will win because he's going to be the only savior. Forget about APC PDP, we don't care. That one is a name. So, Obaseki, no, I'm not coming. Up. Somebody is coming. He's coming. He's coming. He's never going to disgrace himself to you. You are a small boy to him. Who are you to him? You are nobody to him. When he speaks, he vibrates because he belongs to the tiger and the lion command. When he bark, the old world will hear it. And those states will be safe once and for all. That is how it's going to be. If you think when you write this governorship, you hand over again like Oshomula did it, that era is over. Here you are. So out. Newsers are coming online, speaking rubbish. Hey, officer, I'm gonna call you back. Okay, I'm on live video. I'm online. Everyone is hearing you. Just hang up. Don't say your name. Bye bye. Okay. So you can see that these are. Nigeria high-ranking military officer who I called a while ago, they are calling back because they have the best interest of those state. And Nigeria has a oh. But the two people, 
Why would the lecturer be wondered? Why? What did he do? Eh? Because everybody said, let's wait to I hear from the kidnapper. How are you going to wait I hear from the kidnapper? Wait the time, maybe Obasa Samore Joseph is, is in coma right now. For the Obasa to unleash his military and police to go and look for him. Go to every forest. Why do you think FBI? When someone is kidnapped, there will be dog. Everything will be in inside forest. They will be looking for one place to another, from houses to houses. Why have Edo people not come out and say, everyone in Edo State, Wagagwale Rima, Obasedo Samori Joseph, why? Why? Because they are waiting for the news to come. Ah, oh, yeah, oh, no. Yeah, yeah. Everybody will be playing his music. Where will? Emina Sunoda, Bwani. I want to let all Nigerians know that those state is in the, is in the state of emergency. PFM have declared a those state a state of emergency. Any of those state citizens who feel they are not safe, go to any embassy, seek a refuge. You have a right to go to any embassy and seek refuge. Before you go, put it on YouTube, Facebook, video it. Send the video to us. Let us ask the embassy. If Asan, Asan, Wicked Lake, owner, founder, can be given a refuge in London, Ecuador embassy, for how many years is living inside the embassy? Why can't innocent, vulnerable Nigerians be given a refuge in any embassy in Nigeria? Why? It's a question. Then we ask. If you think I'm done, you are making a great mistake. So, that is why I came out this morning to tell other people. Sometimes we misinterpret English. They always say silent is the best answer given to a fool. So, do you think that now, Obasa keep being silent about Samori? What is the answer given? Which fool? Who is the fool? Who is the fool now? That silent is the best answer and give it to a fool. That English is incorrect. By Oba taking silent, or the people silent, which answer, which fool that they give you the answer? Is it Osamori now, or the people that is dying? You see, sometimes, mind what you say. Follow your own language. That is all I want to do. I'm begging everyone, share this video. I am calling on the federal government of Nigeria to intervene into a those state insecurity. I have asked some DIGs, some AIGs, what are we going to do about a state security? All they told me, even the IG, this way his power get. Obaseki is the head. Obaseki is the one that will do everything. Obaseki and Oshomole. And Obaseki and Oshomole, they cannot do anything. SSG is working on that. He's following instruction. Osadio Ogi, Omas He used to be a good man. The deputy governor, that one is a very good guy. I don't care about what people say about him. He cannot say anything. He's under him. If you give a scholar a security job to do and he cannot perform it, then give it to a criminal. Maybe criminal can do it. Criminal turn a good officer. There are some criminals who change their life. They will do better than them. Why can Edo people not call on Obaseki to resign? Why is Edo State House of Assembly not bringing a big vote of no confidence against Governor Obaseki due to the insecurity in Edo State? If Ostonte Aputo Samori, Obaseki has to resign. Obaseki will have, he has to resign. If anything happens to Samori, Obaseki has to resign. He had to resign. And I want to tell this to everyone in the world. We are going to launch Operation Bad Politician. That operation we're going to launch. We're going to stop every bad African politi political leader who are financing terrorists, who are financing kidnappers, who are financing all these criminals. Who are chasing our innocent children out of Africa that create Im uh, migrant that the flowing into the Mediterranean Sea, dying in the sea? We are going to make sure we ban you when you step out of Nigeria. 
bam, you will, you will be numb. Charges against you is sponsoring of terrorists. You are sponsoring terrorism group. And we have all evidence because you are in government. Tell us how many houses you have. Where have you buy house? How much is your salary? How are you getting your money? How do you finance your trip? These are questions that the Western world law enforcement will ask. Like they asked Tony Kabaka, who is financing your trip? He said it's the government. Governor Basaki. So, people say, keep something in your mind. Let me tell you, I have a lot in my mind, though. I have a lot. Let me quickly answer this call. Maybe it's a good news. Hello, my brother. Yeah, but I'm alive. Are you aware of that? I understand. I just want to contribute to what you're saying. Okay. Oh, this our government, sir. Um, there's one thing exciting because we are the one making calls to understand what is going on. There's, the police are not questioning the lady that saw Osayomori last. There's nobody questioning her to know exactly what, because this, we are hearing different story. Even the manager is saying, oh, somebody called yesterday, oh, we saw they saw Osayomori in one village around Benin over here. So why don't you tell us it's yesterday you said we didn't hear, you didn't hear anything so that we, we, we can mobilize people here to look for him. And he continue to, there's no, there's no, there's no, there's no, there's no, there's the world is that tell you a different kind of story. And you are the one that was driving the car and uh, you jump you, uh, out of the car, you were running, you said that they shot you and then there's no, they don't want and uh, we are hearing different stories they, they do away with Osamari. And even people are saying when, when uh, they kidnap him, Osamari was still throwing up, he was vomiting. Okay, now, the, the, the police, nobody is shaking the whole bush around here. There's only one they're supposed to be questioning, supposed to be in their custody right now, questioning her. The, the, the manager that is saying, oh, you heard this yesterday, the, oh, he was in one village around here, you did tell us. So if you are a suspect, everybody is a suspect right now, including me that is speaking right now, everybody is a suspect. The police are supposed to hold you. Okay, let me say this, but I'm not trying to take your time. Uh, you in can see, uh, you can see. Mm. Uh, Odubu father was kidnapped. I'm living with this. The fire, we were, everybody was crying. Including the driver. Did you know what happened? When they tortured the driver, the driver confessed that he is the one that can have the uh, paper. So, but they have done away with the man, but he don't know where he is, but he know the kidnapper wife. They went to go and get the kidnapper wife and the children. So when the people called, they want the money, they asked the wife to talk to the guy. The guy said, oh, sorry. I will release him, release my wife. That is how it works. We all know all the people that is been kidnapping in Nigeria, he got somebody, somebody inside. You know, there's somebody inside. That is the only way we can find someone alive. You know, this guy is not physically okay. You know, so it's a dead dangerous by the day. You know, so those are the things the police have to go over the air. As the people that were there, the lady need to be questioned and the manager they need to be questioned. That's the thing that's serious. That's okay. the thing. Uh, can you test me the manager phone number? Let me call him right now. I will test it to you, bro. Just so I will test it to you. Test it and to then me. That is the, that is the, I even ask him. I, I ask him, I say, listen, I call you by 9 o'clock yesterday, we were already sleeping. Now, why is it that Opa, our Opa, he prays for our Opa? Why is it that our Opa is not even going out yet to address the, 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 the state? And uh, the way I'm looking at it, the people in abroad, we are the ones even doing the main work. The people over there, everybody's scared. They don't want to say anything. They are scared. You know, so our Opa is not addressing it. The government is not addressing it. You know, if, if that was a civilized world, a whole ceremony, uh, uh, the whole city, not even the governor, the whole city, the youth, everybody will mobilize, all that bush to the water, everybody will be searching by now. That is the way it is. The man might be in coma by now, or whatever is over here. So we will fly him alive. That is the thing. Wow. wow. So that is the whole thing. Bro. So he got something to do with people that close to him. Well, so I'm only right now, people might be looking money because I'm only really, really right now, so I'm really don't have no money. They should know that. I said, really it. I no said he has no money. Yeah. I know him. Yeah, but, but I'm is broke right now, so I'm completely broke. We are the ones sending him money. 
I know. I know. Yeah, I know. Uh, you know, you know it. So that's the thing. So everybody, what they should turn their focus like now because they can be able to squeeze a lot of information from that woman because she was the one that ran away from the car. Why will you run away from the car with your husband and now we are hearing that the children was even in the car with uh, her sister? So the whole thing is like, we don't even understand what is going on. You know, they have to question the woman. She, she's the one that saw this my last. She, okay, what was the conversation when they were chasing you? You know, what was the conversation between you and the ceremony? And when you took her from the car, what was the whole thing? You know, you ran away and they were chasing you, not that they were in front of you. Why did you stop the car? That's another question. Why did you stop the car? When you were already ahead of them, why did you stop the car? That's a question. And the one right there, a kidnapper will never shoot you if you are not dangerous to them. Why would they shoot you anyway? And it's by right, your ear or whatever you went to watch to get a private hospital and you are, or you are, you are telling us that, that, you know. So the whole thing is driving, driving us crazy. We all live in a civilized world. We know exactly what is going on. Although all father was kidnapped, like I said it before, he was the driver. All the people that is big up in Nigeria is always one of them in DLA that is doing it. So for us to get the truth, it gotta be the people around him, they gotta be doing some arresting right now, they are arresting those people. That's only way we can get the truth. I squeeze the truth out of them. So okay. send me the uh, send me the number of the of the manager. Let me call him live right now. Mm. Send it. Just put the number plus uh, plus two three four. Do it like that. Let me call it direct. Thank you. Thank you. So as you can see, mm, uh, only one thing I will talk about. Obaseki is out to destroy our traditional ruler. This has nothing to do with our palace. Ah, mega comrade. I want to say that this has nothing to do with our palace. But what I want to talk about. Why is our Benin traditional rulers not calling out a do women, market women, traders to come on the street? That is the only question I have. I will understand Commissioner Gwando was not even in a do state. Why is it that when they want to kidnap us Amore, that is when they travel out? Is he, is he aware? Are, are all these people police officers? Because there are police officers who are doing kidnapping. That is the fact. In Anomigo said it. A lot of police officers in Nigeria who are working with terrorists who use they are in the same gang. They are in the same gang. They are in the same courtist group. If we want to make an arrest in Nigeria, a police officer who is leading the arrest will use his cell phone to call the perpetrator that we are coming to arrest you. I caught an inspector like that. A man that I already know was there. I have my men watching them, some secret military officer that are you. I'll be going around. I don't work by myself since a long time ago. I work with military officers. I don't trust police, Nigerian police. Some of them, a lot of them. This individual inspector, one of them sent a text message to whom we are going to arrest that Eranomigo is coming. Everybody know me from school, from secondary school, in Niger College. They know that if you mess with me, I will take you to the police station. I always go to the police right from time. Ask anyone that knows me. You can ask the double boys. They know me. If you owe me money, I will carry it to the station. Because my family is there. We are high ranking police officer. It's the only place I know you can get your money. But when I was going, a police officer sent a message. We are coming. We went there. It was empty. Then I took that to... Uh, what do you call it? Uh, 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 to go eat. They eat, sir. Are you giving? I say, I don't give. They know me as officer. Don't give, don't take. I only buy them food. And I let him know. I caution the, the inspector. He came to my hotel room and be begging. Why will you do that? I wish I have forgiven him. Police officers. They are kidnappers. Why would police be wearing black? We carry a for the seven, not on uniform. Eh? They will kidnap and change their clothes, put police clothes on them, and you cannot stop them. This is the problem of Nigeria. Why would a woman would be with his husband and said she has a gunshot, and now we are finding out there was no gunshot? 
The wound is not there to prove it. However, they said, this man that called is close to Samori Joseph. He's been in the United States for more than 25 or 30 years. If not, I'm not mistaken. Why, why have they not arrested his wife's sister? Who was there? Why is Commissioner Gwandu not saying anything? Why is Obaseki quiet? That is the question. Immediately I called Commissioner Gwandu yesterday. He did not answer my phone, but he called someone else. I have not known that someone else he called. He called that person. So, people are here that can I do it all, all alone? No. Even come out. Do you know how much I spent since, since yesterday calling here and there? Nobody knows. I'm doing all this. When I'm crying, people will say, Ran amigo, or the Europe we are go. If you don't put it on your most sorry. Don't know it. Go more sorry. Eh? Who said it? Nobody. Let me see. Effective. Uh... Jesus. Okay, where is the number? Is he going to send it or not? Uh, okay. So, however, uh, I am going to go ahead and do what I have to do. I am begging everyone, if you have any information, call people that you know you can call. If possible, call, uh, I heard that Fabumo and uh, Maliki are the one running here and there. So, if you can call uh, Fabumo or Maliki, or uh, a do musician musical group call them please Eranomigo is not coordinating with anybody i am not speaking on behalf of the family i am speaking for my own because i know Simon joseph is a good man so that is all i want to tell everyone if you are in abroad please Call your family. If you have a police officer high ranking, call them to call Commissioner Gwando. If you have a military officer high ranking, call them to call Commissioner Gwando. Call them to call Buhari. Usamori Joseph is the pride of Edo. The truth has to be spoken. If these our fathers are standing for the truth, these things will not happen. Because all the greed of money. Give him money. If Obaseki did not stop him from going to Europe with me last month, maybe it wouldn't have happened. Maybe he wouldn't have played in the palace. Maybe we would have still been in Europe by now. That is the truth. I put the post out on my page. Everybody saw it. Even his own boys that were in New York we were supposed to go to Italy with us and meet us and play with us. Because of greed of all these things, we, it's good to be honest. I hope one day when he come out, he will know that it's good to stand for the truth completely all the way down. Because sometimes when you cover, it will backfire on you. Hello? 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 Hello, good afternoon. Yeah, good afternoon. Yeah. Yeah, I'm calling, I'm calling from Australia and uh, I'm just calling to contribute with the topic you are talking about. Okay, go ahead. Yeah, uh, I'm retired here in Australia and uh, since uh, yesterday we have gotten the news of uh, the guy kidnapped in uh, Edo State, you know. So actually my... Uh, my own uh, suggestion is going to Edo people. I just want to use this opportunity to call for all Edo's in Europe. You know, this kind of uh, personality is not only somebody that uh, they, they will go only online, be making only uh, YouTube or Facebook and most of them talking blah, blah, blah. You know, it's not only us shouting, shouting, shouting. They should help you out. I think if all the youth that is in Europe should come out in masses and protest and call upon the government of Nigeria to investigate the governor of Edo State and beg and ask the order of uh, the kingdom of Bini to help them investigate the kidnapping of this mobile man. This will go a long way. Not just going on YouTube, because a lot of youth in Nigeria, they don't have access to internet. 
But if a door can come out in Madrid in different cities in Europe and protest and call upon the people at home to show them how painful they are to hear this particular sad news, this will go a very, very, very long way. Because of the architecture in Nigeria today, our government will be scared, will not like such thing to happen again. And I believe that this will help the government of Abuja to do something. It's not all the kingdom leaving this job alone for you. You should talk, you should not talk, you should not talk. They should keep talking. Because those people in the kingdom or those people at home, they are supposed that talking will go a long way. It will go very, very long way. They should not leave this job for you alone. When someone look upon you physically, we can see a kind of allow me to use this word from kind you act like someone that's insane. It does not mean because you don't know what you are doing, but this work has been taking taking eating your life, eating your flesh, eating everything, everything about you. But these people they can only go to YouTube and start making nonsense video, talking Monica, the other place, the other place. Why can't these people come together as a group? They can form one group. They can form a tribal fighter group of those people and work together as a group. Work together as a group in Europe. Not working individually, looking where to make money, sending me money here. This is not it cannot happen here though. And I want to tell every Nigerian and Nigeria as well, this kidnapping is not in the door. And let me tell everybody that listen, this is a starter. It is a starter. It's a beginning. Because we are going to present an election 2019. These people have started their method of kidnapping these people now. They are only planning because of the upcoming election. And my question to everyone that is listening to this, my, this my call is, who is the next? Who will be the next? It can be my mother. It can be your father. It can be your brother. When you say it didn't concern you, I'm telling you sooner or later, it will concern you. And those people in Europe, share on you. Rise up. Rise up. Go to protest. Ask your kingdom to please do something. Ask the commission of Penicity uh, to wake up and investigate who kidnapped this one. Let me tell you the truth. Every kidnapping that happened in every state in Nigeria, the government know about it. The police know about it. I am an evil man. Nobody can come to my village and kidnap somebody in my village without knowing the track rules living in my village. And this one man came out from the um, power as I'm hearing, doing something and going for someone pick him on the way. I'm telling you, a government cannot tell me that nobody from his home knows this kidnapping. It is the body that they kidnap, kidnap, they kidnap him. So please, my fellow uh, Nigerian people, those people in Europe, those people should come out and do something. And your coming out uh, to make protests can create a very big awareness so that we can have better Nigeria tomorrow. Thank you. God bless you, brother. Oh, God, Jesus. This is what I called for yesterday. If you watch my video yesterday, I call every Edo people to come out in masses and occupy police headquarters, occupy the governor office in Jaroe. But they say an amigo or talogwe. That is the truth. They left it for me alone. They left it for me alone. All the work in Edo State. Sometimes I'm tired. I want to quit. But I ask myself a question. If I quit now, what is the result? I do people in Europe. I came and visit Europe. I did what none of them can do. Not even in 10 years to come, they cannot do it. Instead of them to appreciate PFM to thank People Freedom Movement who work selfless, contribute, send money to me when money is over. They did not thank them. They were insulting us. All the admin were on fire. Money, money, money. We were begging money, borrowing money. They could not. They were laughing or talk way. It could be your grandmother tomorrow. 
kidnapping will can kidnap your own mother tomorrow. Let me see who you're gonna run to. All they want to do now is to rush and get an ID card. Even monthly, they cannot even say, Oh, okay. Everybody say, Don't leave your job, leave your job. How can I go to work with this? Don't you think I'm a human being? When you see a lion, children are sick, the lion will be sick. Tiger children are sick, they will be sick. Watch it and say it. They will be crying, shaking head. All they want to do, they spend money in courtesy, they spend money in group, they spend money on churches, pastors that don't care about them. But what would make an impact in our life? We don't care. Why would Tony Kabaka come and say I'm insulting his commissioner? Is it not the same commissioner that is allowing this thing to be happening? How is Tony saving Edo State now? He's not saving, he's creating problems in Edo State. That is the truth. And his family are everywhere asking, try to try to silence anyone that speaks the truth. Eh? It's not gonna happen. Hello. Oh, give me a second, brother. Hello. 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 Yes. Hello, sir. Yes. Are you online? Yeah, I'm online. Right, yes. Okay. I want to contribute to this um, topic. Go ahead. The truth of the matter. The truth of the matter is, um, there is something that uh, people are scared of. I don't know. And um, I don't want them to push you to say it. I don't want them to push you to be the one to say what they are scared of. Right. Because I know. Yeah. Because the truth of the matter is we keep blaming pastors, pastors, pastors. Are pastors more past powerful than our traditional rulers? No. Uh, so why are we blaming pastors? If you want to kill his you kill his spirit from the head. If president, governors, they want to campaign, where did they go to? Where did they go to seek uh evidence from? Is it pastors or traditional rulers? You're right, absolutely. So, so if you see, the traditional realize that they're the father of the people. No father would be happy to see his children suffer. It's their right, their duty to call whoever is in charge to, 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 to order. Call the president, call the uh, lawyers. The people of the traditional rulers in Nigeria, they all are politicians. They have saved their people. They have saved their people. And the truth of the matter is, I we, we, this week we think Nigerians are stupid. Just like Boko Haram started with like a joke. If you come one day, you will be surprised what those stupid masses they look them to be we do to them. Now you are fighting with just cause. If you see a lot people making video attacking somebody that is fighting the just cause, you can channel your energy for rubbish. Okay. I, I, criticism is welcome. If somebody calls you, if I need to do so, soon, not be so, change up my hair, not by making video to spoil your name, not by making video to insult you. You have American passport, you don't need Italian passport. In fact, like they are going to offer you <laughs> common life they don't have, water they don't have, good health care they don't have, good education they don't have, food they don't have. People are suffering. For them to see reunions with you and stand up to fight for their right. Stand up to fight for their right. They are, they, are, they are misbehaving. They are, they, they are criticizing. They will say this, they will say, who in uh, those states, among those that uh, are that are making money, who else has a those produce as a millionaire? Nobody. They, they stop they, they stopped Adler from making money now. Now, Adler will be at that street because they need money, they need to survive. They don't do anything to survive. They have goals, they have the machines. They will do anything to survive. You think they don't know? The police don't know where to go to arrest. They will return in the name. They turn it beneath the man. They arrest. His son was kidnapped. He caught somebody. He, 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 
We took it out. They, they, they returned the song. I don't want to mention it. So, this thing is just um, a mirage. Just kill those people, people's intelligence. The people are so valuable. It's not about APC, it's not about KDP. Thank you. I, it's abroad, abroad. If you want to talk about election in abroad, it's not a political party that will choose for you. There are grassroots people that will choose somebody to go and represent them in the political party. But in Nigeria, it's not systematic that it is the political party that will bring the people, the, will bring somebody the people will vote for. So if they choose, if the political party choose who you, they want to, to govern you, who will that person report to? Who is that person afraid of? It's not the people that got in there. It's not the people that got the people that got the masses. So until the masses begin to realize all these politicians are the areas, don't they have communities where they live? Why is the people from putting fire, setting the house and leave? Tell them with senators are making bees, you want bees every day. And the senators are spirit. When they have their communities, where they come from, we send you to the presenters. Before you make bees, you must come and take permission from us. Tell us this is what they are planning. You will like it. Then they just go there, they just talk their lives, they make bees, they do that, they suit them. The people take it, everything comes that they are following, everything they bring, they follow, everything they bring. Commissioner Gado is killing them, arresting them, kidnappers are doing their own, and those who are taking it, they are following it. Because they are only parents talk. They say, not mind me, they are on their side, not mind me, this is that, not mind me, this is that. And I'm going to spend this money fighting for your freedom. That is why the, the, the person I respect again is uh, uh, this uh, Agbogu, that boy, that boy is still trying. I will beg you, I just want you to beg you, please, hold that boy as a son. That's why the, the mistake he made before. Because he still acknowledge you in his videos, holding him as a son. If somebody can make a mistake, and the person can, 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 can realize this mistake and uh, correct it. He has realized this mistake and is correcting it. So the truth of the matter is that the people of a state in Nigeria, they are so afraid. They cannot speak for their right. If you speak for their right, for your right, ah, how many, the public have to, uh, they say 2,000 boys. How many people are in the state? This is 4 million, 4 million. How can 2,000 boys be more longer than 4 million? How can, how can, see, this thing is just, it's just, there's a the court process. The deputy governor of the state that I'm talking about is, it's even, it's, 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 it's more than about obesity. So if they, should work, if they don't want, if they want change, let the people act. If they want change, let them come out. Let their voice be Let them unite and stop this APC for PDP bullshit. Political party and tactical country. What can I do? They, they stole the youth to themselves. The weapon these people are using is disunity. They don't want them to unite. They bring religion, they bring politics, they bring tradition, they bring uh, church, they bring their uh, marks, they bring everything to scatter the people. The foolish people are accepting it. If you, 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 you are fighting for one man because you say a political party, and your people are suffering. Your people are suffering. They don't see. That's why I say any body that has but is showing one politician. Okay. okay, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. God bless you. Oh, wow. Uh, Jesus. Uh, please, I have to get, uh, do a lot of things. I've not eaten and I have not done anything. Uh, people are waiting for me, a lot of things, and I, I, have, uh, I have to attend court on Monday as well. So even my lawyers have not uh, been able to go there because of this issue. You can see what I'm going through is not easy. It's not easy for me. I cannot sugarcoat it. Uh, what I'm begging is that uh, I, I will call on uh, every two citizens in Europe. If you want to listen, fine. If you don't want to listen, you can insult me. I'm used to it. I will call on anyone in, a, in, a, in Europe, in America. Forget about the ENA in America. A do national body, whatever they call them. Uh, let me quickly do one thing. Let me call the number I said I was going to call a while ago. 
then uh, God help me. The worst of all, most of these people in a, in a, uh, America here, yeah, they know me very well. They know me and they know what I'm doing. But out of jealousy, it's worrying them. You know, it's worrying them. Jealousy. That is the problem. Hello? Okay. I'm trying to call a... Uh, I'm trying to call Osamore Joseph manager. Uh... But he didn't answer that call. Uh, let me see how I can call the second number. Because this individual sent me... This individual sent me the number of Osamore Joseph manager. Let me try and call the second number. Uh, you know, I'm just tired. I'm tired. Just tired. Press star to copy this tune for 15 hours only. Hello. Uh -huh, hello, we may are here. Hello, uh, Please, uh, this is a uh, Ran Amigo Mega Comrade. Leader of PFM. Yes, my brother. Mm. Yes, yes. How is everything? Yeah. Well, we thank God. We thank God. Uh, is, is this not manager? So I'm already just manager, right? Yes, yes. Okay. To you. Okay. How is the situation? What is the what is the update? Well, the update is that we're still waiting for contact. There's no contact yet. But uh, some rumor is going around that they started in in one of the villages along uh, that uh, upper Kewa villages. So the police and other military agency have gone to see whether we can get any clue. You know, that's the, that's the latest from this afternoon. That they, somebody said, this started was a one of the some of the one of the villages. So they are on their trail. Okay. Uh, and uh, uh, what about the those individuals that was in the vehicle with him when he was kidnapped? Are you aware of that? Yes. Well, well yes. Uh, the wife was there, and the children they were there. The wife in the hospital. She was shot in the head. She's still in the hospital, you know, and the other ones are just leaving toddlers. Okay, so uh, anyway, uh, well, with what you have spoken now, because uh, what we are receiving here is a different story. So, but uh, uh, that uh, we just want the safety of Osamori Joseph. You know, I'm very close to him, right? Yes, I do. Okay, you know, he was supposed uh, to follow me to European tour to Obaseki. One I, or the other, the I remember. Okay. Yes, I remember that. Yeah. So, uh, if he would have gone to that tour by now, we would have still been in Europe. You know that, right? I know, I know. Yes. So, please, I hope he come back safely. Uh, that, I hope he come back safely. This one will be a lesson yes. to others. When God is using someone to save your life and you don't know it. So, uh, it's like that. I love him. Uh, we are doing whatever I can do uh, to make sure he come yes. back on safely. The way you are spoken, I think your heart is clear. Uh, may God bless you. Please do whatever it is. You have my number. You can call me if you need any assistance. Thank you very much. Okay, Thank God you. bless you. Yeah. So, uh, as you can see now, I don't lie. It's the truth. If he would have followed through, he agreed with me, with no money. But Obaseki, one way or the other, the pressure him, he changed. We would have been in Europe by now. Maybe God sent me. Know what is at hand. God sent me. Use freedom to draw him out of this danger. The manager confirmed it. But because of greed of money. Money. The truth had to be spoken. So, but yeah, I am still fighting for him. That is the truth. So, this one should be a lesson to others. Please. If you involve in this kidnapping, just leave him alone. That man have no money. I was even supposed to send him money, but I didn't do it because the way uh, he changed after he agreed with everything. 
They don't have money. Like what one gentleman said, that is the one sending money to him. That is true. That is true. If I wasn't, if I wasn't a honest leader, that was a more trip would have cost me problem in Europe because I already put it. It was gonna go with me. But because people know that I'm a honest man, when I come to the public, people say, "If I ever out of a public, it's true." Say if if I didn't come out and say the whole thing, nobody would back me. No, he wasn't afraid. I asked him before we started. And he said, no, he's not afraid. He wasn't afraid. Up and second sent people to him. Little money. Maybe yes or no. But we just pray for God to help. So, that is the truth. I love you guys. I'm tired. Please, whatever you can do. Uh, I do not just uh, fought in the... Mm. Who's this one again? Uh, okay, I got it. So, whatever you can do, if you're in Europe, please let us focus on how we can help. Uh, I will call on Edo people in Europe. We need to educate our brothers at home. You think they are graduate or they have masters? Let me tell you. My last, my son, my five years old son. Is smarter than a lot of graduates in Nigeria. That is the truth. At five years old, he's already reading everything. Everything. Go to the police station if you doubt what I'm saying. A graduate, a police officer cannot write a statement. When you go there, they'll give you paper to write on your own. So we have to educate them. If you are in Europe, and I want to call on every Edo community worldwide, Japan, Italy, London, US, everywhere, Canada, every Edo community. I am calling on you. Don't do this for random. You will do it for your sake, the sake of Edo people. We want you to call the police IG, not the AIG, Inspector General of Police. If you need his phone number, I have three of his number. Contact my secretary, Chief Izoba. Contact him. Yeah, it's all about if you are there, can you put your number in the public, please? Uh, his phone number is uh, plus one six one seven five one six nine six six two. I repeat, plus one six one seven five one six nine six six two. Contact Chief Azoba. Uh, I will forward the number to you. You call the IG, or if you want to email, you can email him. Let him know the situation that all Edo community will need security in Edo State. Please, 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 begging for money. Who is begging for money? I beg you. Do you people give money? Beg you. Those are just stories. You people cannot work. You cannot do anything. You cannot give money. All you can do is to come and insult people. Nothing you can do. Get a job, you will not get a job. Savu is already on top, you will not. All you want to do is to be a constituent, uh, 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 creating a, a, a problem everywhere and causing chaos everywhere. Causing chaos, that's what you do, creating problem. That is all you are doing. So that is it. I was going to try to call this uh, Edo, Edo president, ENA, Edo national body president in the United States. I was trying to call him. Let me see. He never answered his phone. I don't even know if it's functioning or anymore. Because uh, that organization is really, I don't care about it, you know. So, I don't really know. So, let me see if I can call him. If they can do anything to help Ambassador Samori Joseph. Uh, it belongs to, it's our father. Mm, it's the pride of Edo. So, let's see. I will do my best. If you are in any organization in Europe, please. Anywhere you are in Europe, please do whatever it takes. If you can contact uh, our secretary, then we can. Uh, president of. Uh, let me see. If it, uh, oh God, it is not easy. Let me see if this is the guy. No. So. Uh, president of. Uh, I 
I don't know. I cannot get the number right now. So, uh, I hope. Mm. I cannot. So, I do people, please. Whatever you can do to help our brother, please, our father, go ahead and do it. I am begging everyone, please, 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 please. Uh, please do it. Please do it. Don't don't run away from it. Uh, don't do it because of it, Aramigo. Just do it for yourself. So, I don't have the number I was going to call. I have to sign out. I have to do a lot of things. I have it, but I cannot find it now. So, a good community worldwide, please try it. All other communities should help. Uh, okay, money for Puerto Rico. What concerns me and Puerto Rico? I pray for them. God bless them. I'm not a humanitarian. I'm a freedom fighter. I fight for the war. I'm the president of the poor citizen worldwide. The defender of the voiceless and defenseless. That is what I am. I'm not a, I'm not a charity that, that, that goes around. So that is it. Um, so leave him alone. Let him just go. I have to go. I love you. God bless you. You can see I'm tired. I love you. God bless you. Please share this video. Share it. Share this video. Let people know. I'm calling on everyone. Please, if you want, if you can, if you can assist, call Maliki or call Fabumo or call uh, this other musician they mentioned a while ago. Call them most especially Fabumo and Maliki. They are working hands to hand. Maliki, I don't know him. I think he's a good guy. What he's doing right now, he shows that he really somebody was with them. So, so I mean, the guys, you should call them and whatever you can do. We don't need money, but we just need help. How they can mobilize people to protest. So thank you. God bless you. Thank you. I love you. Bye-bye.